We're going to create a contest that has both a web component and an SMS component. Um, it's actually going to be two contests, and we'll link them together. The reason why we'd want to do this, uh, well, there, there are many benefits. Um, first off, it allows someone to enter through a website as well as through SMS. So if someone does not have an SMS-capable phone, they can still enter the contest. Um, it also allows people who enter through SMS a chance to enter a second time through the web. So it's a way to get more uh, information about the people who enter your contests. Um, and the great thing about linking them together is that you can manage all the entries in one spot. And you can even have the system pick winners for you, and it will do so from both contests together. So let's take a look and uh, build one of these. First thing we're going to do is create a regular sweepstakes from your dashboard. And uh, fill in the basic stuff. Oops. I need a new design for your, whoops. Okay. Okay. Um, if we had SMS contests to link to, we would see them in this pull down menu. Otherwise, if you want to link one, to, link to an SMS contest, we'll create that after saving this. Let's go ahead and set up a few basic things here. Oops, I'm going to upload a file or an image. And for the content, I'm just not going to put anything here. Um, in the bounce back email, which is what someone gets when they enter the contest, we'll see when we come back here in a minute that there is some extra text we can add in, which allows, uh, which informs the person entering the contest that they can enter a second time through SMS. Uh, but we'll have to come back to see that because we have to create the other contest first. Um, when you do run two contests together as a linked contest, the uh, you you probably want to collect a mobile number um, as part of your form. This will allow you to send messages to everyone in the contest via SMS um, instead of sending some SMS and the other's email in order to contact all your participants. So that's something there. And for now, we're good. I'm going to save. And because I checked that little box, it's going to take us to uh, an SMS contest, which the system just set up for us. And with this SMS contest, um, let's make it active. It's set up the same start and end times. It's set up the same title. Uh, the, you want to pick your keyword if you have more than one. And uh, if you want to put rules, you can put rules. Um, notice that under the entry bounce back message, thanks for entering. You'll see down here that it's given us a little piece of text that we can copy and paste in our message. And this lets the person entering through the SMS side of things, um, gives them a link to enter the regular contest. Um, and then down here where it says automatically pick a winner, well, because we're linking the contest together, whatever you set in the normal contest, the standard contest, um, will be what the system uses as far as are we going to contact winners or, or not. However, if you are going to automatically pick a winner, then you're going to want to put in a message uh, for the SMS contest participants. Of course, you would not put this message, but I am just for testing. OK, and we're all done. Let's go ahead and save. And then as one last thing, Let's go back to our regular contest, go to Edit, and scroll down to the contest bounce back message, bounce back email. You'll see now we have this little thing here, enter a second time by texting web design to 41212. And I'll paste that in, and that uh, will go out in the email uh, that the person will get once they enter the contest. So let's go ahead and save this. And great. And really quickly, uh, to demonstrate how this works, I'm going to go ahead and enter the contest. Uh, let's see. Preview contest page. And put in my mobile number. And enter the contest. And we should see. 
A note here, thank you, you've been entered. Enter a second time, text web design to 41212. And I'm going to do that right now. Okay, so I just texted in to the contest to enter through that method as well. Um, let's go ahead and go back to this page and refresh and let's take a look at our contest. Now it says we have two entries. When I go to the report to look at the entries, it loads them up and you'll see that I've got the two entries now. This one um, is the mobile number, is the mobile entry. And this one Oh no, this one's the mobile entry and this one is the website entry. So it's put them both together in one form. Um, I can choose to only see the one contest entries if I like or to see both. At any time I could pick a winner from either of these two entries and you'll see up here that I can at any time send or schedule an email or send or schedule an SMS message. Um, when I click on sending the SMS message it says there are two entries, and we can send the SMS message just straight to this one contest uh, that we're on, or we could include the entry from the linked contest, which is the SMS contest. So um, if that's confusing to you, please just give me a call, and we would type in a message, uh, click Schedule, and we'd be done. So that's how you link uh, a contest with an SMS contest, and best of luck.